All right, guys, welcome back to LMD. So we are here in Chris's Mega Cab. It's got a bunch of fun goodies, and I'm going to be trying out a full manual valve body today. So let's fire it up. Don't lie. This thing's got all the hand-me-downs from the dually. Yeah, so what all has been done to this thing before we drive it so people know? Ba basic. Yeah. Well, the current setup is like the third powertrain from the dually because we have multiple powertrains. So it's a stock block 6.7 fill, stock 6.7 crank, beans 12 mil gridlock girdle, apex triple beam rod, stock 6.7 piston, a stock head with port work and side draft, flux diesel 250%, twin stock pumps, VS8396 double ball bearing charger, single, and Muldoon's full manual valve body, our trainee, um, signature shaft, you know, just the typical, it's the just good, good street truck. Yeah. The good cattle, the good street truck. Yeah, a couple good size kits, you know. All right, so yeah, we got our valve body here, and looks like, so this top one is uh, lock up, and then this bottom one's overdrive, yep. right? All right. Yep. Well, I've never driven one, so let's see. So, do I click it all the way back? Yep, squeeze it all the way, that's reverse. That feels like first. It will go back any further. Uh, there you go. That's first. That's first. Okay. Now, when you go to second, before you take off, hang on. Then you just hit it and go to second. That's second. Squeeze it and hit it. Third. Now, if you bump it again, it's neutral. Okay. So then it's overdrive and then lock up. Or is it lock up then overdrive? It just depends on how much party fun you want to have as to lock up. But obviously, yeah, overdrive is last. All right. Well, I'm just going to initially take it and easy. She's a smoker because she's turned up. Oh, well, I know how the big singles are, man. Straight back. Third. There you go. And Lock then, it. There you go. Now bring it up. Bring it up. Up, 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 up. Overdrive. There you go. Nice. It's so simple. It's pretty simple. How do I go out of overdrive? Do I just back up? Yeah, just turn overdrive off. So that's overdrive off, but yep. it's still locked up. Yeah. And so yeah. It's locked up, up and down. So I'll unlock. Now you're unlocked. So now I'm unlocked. So if I'm going to turn around here, yep. Try to get around this truck. Yeah, you'll fit. Okay. And then that's first. Yep. Okay. The downshifting coming up is always interesting in a big training like this. Right. So I typically wait till you know I'm like five or eight miles an hour before I downshift all the way. Because <laughs> you could feel how the tires kind of screech. Yeah. No. Yeah, I definitely felt that. All right. So this time, get on it a little bit sooner, and then lock it. And listen to the charger. Lock it uh, in second? Yeah. Okay. Get it? There you go. That third. Now you just drive over ground. And then smokes it out. <laughs> yeah. Dude. Yeah, we're not even going to video it. No, we're, we're not going to look behind it. it. Yeah, so now you can start working it. Working I it will up. say it spools decent. Yeah, when you when you come up hard, drive overdrive. Drive overdrive. Then it'll right. be on. All right, all right. I'm so, gonna try. You can go down here and turn around. All right. Yeah, go ahead and bring it up. A second, bring it up. Lock it. No, unlock. Lock. Bring it up a little bit more. Like it goes, man. Like that? I just felt, I mean, it just, you know, it pulled you back. Dude. All right. All right. I want to hop out and I want you to drive it so I can actually see how it's like really done, right? Why? Because you're the one who knows how to do this, man. Dude, it's different. I mean, it takes a long time to get used to. But yeah, once that's you're good. You're good. Yeah, no, that makes sense. The old Mega. She always puts out. I don't know why. Always puts out. She always works, man. That's crazy. 
That, man, that's fun. It makes me want to learn that. It makes me want to get one and play around right. with it, you know? We'll it, probably go blow it up now, so I it's know. all good. We'll see. <laughs> yeah, knowing you, you'll probably put it in four-wheel drive. Actually, it's exactly what I was going to do. <laughs> everything's better in four-wheel drive. Four, everything's better in four. Everything's better in four. All right, you run tune three. We're going to go to tune four. Tune four. Tune four. Right. Coming up. Here we go. We're recording. Four-wheel drive don't like turning around. No, it doesn't. Okay, I think you just sold me on some 625s for my truck. I gotta get my truck to do that. <laughs> Y'all, this thing freaking rips. It's like the perfect amount for a daily driver. 250 percent? Well, I don't know about <laughs> that part, <laughs> but the thousand horsepower part with a full manual, yeah, it's perfect for daily driving. Oh yeah. It can be completely cool if you wanted to. It, it can be completely calm and tame and, you know, you can carry conversation yeah and you can we did race week with it like 1700 miles or something yeah it's just nuts it just works but yeah they are completely daily drivable i love it did kick a code i'm curious to see what that is we over it's not even overheated or is that even read right oh no that's correct that's correct that's correct that's 100 percent accurate here i'll show you once we After, read our dude codes. my truck would be super hot i guess it's those big oil coolers oh right? we got a map sensor code <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the oil coolers yeah. and the coolant mod. Yeah, right there, 150 degree coolant temp. That's crazy. And we just did like three pulls back to back. Yeah. That felt really good, that yeah. last one. Yeah. Happy truck. Happy truck. It's crazy. People don't believe me, but whatever. <laughs> no. Whatever. It's here, filled block. Here we are. Day here we car. are. We're doing it, man. Love it. Whew. Well, that's driving a full manual valve body. Like and subscribe. That's right.